Good morning, everybody. Namaste. Are we ready to go? Okay. Start with a nice stretch. Take your arms and round your back. Lift the belly. So you feel like you're sinking back a little bit to stretch your lower back, to open your back, soften the shoulders. Mm, making enough space in your back to even get your head down. Stretching, stretching, stretching. And then lift the belly. Keep the ribs down, keep the stomach in. Relax the back. Pull the arms. Pull them up as high as they can go. Stretch, but keep the back relaxed. And exhale the arms back behind you. Place the hands into the floor. Keep the ribs relaxed. There's a nice way to just scoop in the lower belly and open the chest. Pressing into the hands, lifting the tummy. Exhale to come back and come seated. Take a deep breath in, lift your hands. Pulling the energy up, place your hands behind your neck. Exhale, turn to one side. Inhale. Exhale, turn the other side. Inhale. Place your thumbs onto your forehead. What do you call a temple? <laughs> Give a pressure. Shoulders relax. Elbows forward. Interlock the hands and stretch up to the sky. Shoulders relax. Ribs relax. Back opens. Tuck the chin right in. And then exhale, let the head drop back. And release. Okay, close the eyes for a moment. Just notice your natural breathing. Soften the jaw, soften the cheeks. On the inhalation, feel the spine growing a millimeter taller. And settle into the exhalation. Stay with the eyes closed. Inhale, inhale, and after the inhalation, pause and hold the breath for five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, again, inhaling, one, two, three, four, five, pull the lungs, hold the breath, five, four, Three, two, one. Exhale. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Normal in and out. Soften shoulders. In. And out, go one more time, breathing and keep relaxed on your inhalation, expand the ribs to the side, stay down in the earth, hold the breath, suspend, five, four, three, two, one, 
Exhaling 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. On your next inhale, interlock your hands together, pull them up, keep the body relaxed. You're stretching out, looking up at your hands, let your spine exhale. Release. Take your hands again behind your back and soften the ribs, scoop from the belly, press into the hands, opening the chest. Exhale to come back. Take your arms in front of you and as you inhale, lift the hands. Feel the lungs expand. Hands behind your head, exhaling to one side. Inhale. Exhale, other side. Inhale. Into, take the thumbs to the temples. Push. Interlock the hands. Keep the ribs relaxed. Back relaxed. Stretch. Shoulders down, but lengthen up. But do try and stretch your upper arms next to the ears. Take your chin to the chest. Feel the arms pulling back. The tummy down. Inhaling up. And if you can, if it's not nice for the neck, don't do. Try and lengthen and let the head drop back. Keep your arms going up and up and up. Exhale, coming back. Release. Come around onto your hands and knees. Gently move your body, lifting one shoulder. So you're turning, taking the one hip. You just try and stretch your side and you change the other side. Pull, pull the shoulder up, let the hip come to the side. Keep the tummy up, don't do it with an arch. Keep tummy up, think of the hip right into the shoulder, getting a stretch. Think of lifting even more under your chest. Drop the head, lift under the chest. Lift, 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 lift. Feel the lift in the belly. Keep the lift on the bottom side of your body as you extend, looking up and arch. Don't think of it as a back bend. Think of it as a lift and a trying to lengthen out. And then oh, push your back up again. Lift the armpits, press, press. Think of lifting the front side of your body very high. And last one, keep the tummy lifted, shoulders relaxed, try and extend out. And round your back, press down. From this position, keep lifted very high, very high in the chest. Tuck your toes and you'll push into the hands, rolling into your down dog. Press, breathe. And you can walk the back of your legs out, bending, stretching, if you like. Walk towards your hands. Keep the knees bent. And try and stretch. If your hands come off the floor, that's great. Hold the shins. Otherwise, tip your fingers and try and stretch your back. Coccyx goes down so that you can lift the belly, drop the ribs, and lift the chest. And pull up, pull up. So dropping the ribs means they're going down towards your hip bones. Keep pushing, pushing, and the push makes you start to come up. Push into the legs, push, lift the tummy, squeeze in the thighs, straighten the legs if you like, rolling up. Good, let's do salute to the sun. Place your hands into your heart, squeeze buttocks. Open the hips. Inhale, reach and lift out of your hips. Stretching up and open. Exhale, lift. 
hands down to the floor. Inhale, open the upper back, tuck your chin. Exhale, step right, hold that there for a moment. Tippy fingers, just good. Lifting and opening the upper back. So don't let it drop. Don't try and look up. Lift your chest, lift your tummy, press on your legs, square the hips, and try and then from a lifted chest, try and lengthen out. Plant your hands, push and step back. You lift your chest, push your heels back and lengthen the neck. Bring your knees down if you want to or go directly down from here. Feel the lift in the belly, opening the chest, come down. Inhale, drop your head, roll up, cobra. Exhale, roll down. Inhale, roll up. Keep your head rolling. Take it down. Now the chest lifts. It's like a spinal movement. Your chest uh, extends. Now you lift your chest up, dropping your head, looking at your navel, uncurling, unrolling. Legs are still strong and lifted up at the back. Now extend it out at the back. Exhale. Lift me. Inhale. Hug the elbows towards each other. Exhale. One more. Inhale. Only go as far as you can. Maybe the elbows are a little bit bent. Take your toes. Lift in the tummy. Squeeze a bum. Down and facing dog. Breathe. Press the thighs back. Lift the toes. Reach back. Good. Scooping from the belly, lifting from the chest. Step, step to the hands. Keep lifting in the tummy. Extend out. Keep strong in the legs. Press into the feet. Feel the heaviness through your feet. Feel the strength through your feet. Then the feet start pressing. Even if the knees are bent, they press down. You keep lifting. The legs take the first part. The hips come open. Keep lengthening. Oh, open the chest. Exhale, relax, second side, inhale, lift, reach, pull, make a big circle, pull, 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 open the chest, exhale, fold, inhale, lengthen, exhale, take the left leg back, hold that there, tippy fingers, if you like, or flat hands, lift the thigh, doesn't mean to say straighten the knee, but try and lift the thigh, opening your hip flexor, lengthen, ribs relax, strong in the front leg. Plant your hands, lift and step back. Push your heels away from you, lifting your belly. Come down. Knees or chaturanga, all the way to the floor. Drop the head as you open the shoulder blades, down your back, rolling up. Press. Let's do just three. Exhale, come down. Inhale, tuck chin, roll up. Squeeze buttocks. Exhale. Last one. Inhale. Lift tummy, tuck toes, drop the head, and press into the hands. Breathe. Bring the knees down to the floor. Release your toes and slide your hands back towards your knees, squeezing your bum, rolling up to standing on your knees. Hands into the lower back, or you could hold the fingers facing down. A nice way to do this is, if you can, putting your hands into your lower back, turning your fingertips up. Lifting up in the belly, tuck chin, and lift, lift, lift out of your hips. Think of lifting, squeeze the leg, Towards each other, press your knees down, just go as far as you can. Lengthen. Try and push your hips down and long. Inhale to come up. Exhale. Slide your hands forward, keep lifting belly, tuck toes, down dog. Inhale, step your right leg forward between your hands. Swivel the back foot to 45. Now you're more than welcome to keep your front knee bent. Hands on tippy fingers, try and feel the strength in your legs, feel the feet and press 
into the feet, lengthen the spine. Keep the left hand on the floor. Even if the right knee is bent, keep it bent, it's okay. Take the right arm to your shoulder and think of pulling your right elbow up as you press down left hand, keeping the left leg strong. Roll it up if you can, stretch your hand to the sky. Bend the right knee very deep into 90 and reach your left arm forward and twist. Okay, I'm just gonna take this arm forward again. So now this right arm is gonna open, try and twist towards the right, pulling your left arm longer, twist. Three, five, four, three, keep lifting tummy, four, uh, two, one, and place it down. Good, join the feet in the front. Extend the spine, exhale, fold. Inhale, lift the belly, reach, squeeze buttocks. Reach back. Exhale. Good, one more. Okay, squeeze buttocks. Inhale, reaching up, open the chest. Exhale, lift. And fall down. Inhale, left, open the chest. Exhale, take either leg. We're only going to do one more, so should have been right, but doesn't matter which leg you take. Squeeze buttocks, press through the arms, feel the strength. Legs, arms, come down. Tuck the chin, roll it up. Mm, hopefully, feeling nice in the back. Left tummy. Lifting up in the tummy first, squeeze the buttocks, tuck toes, down dog. Breathe. Again, keep lifting upwards. As you rise on your toes, scoop in the tummy, bring the knees down, release the toes and slide your hands back, push the pelvis forward. Tuck chin, inhale, open the chest. If you like, hands anyway. Uh, even holding the thighs, but the work is to keep lifting out of your hips, lift strong legs, lift, open the chest, lengthen, press your hands forward, open the stomach, inhale to come up, exhale, sit down. Okay. Place your knees together, go into hair pose. Hair pose is a very rounded position where you curl your tummy. Take your head as close to the knees as you can. So, of course, depending on how much you can do that, depending how close the legs, the head is going to get to the legs. So, just go as far as you can, shoulders relax, lift the tummy, scoop, bring your head down onto the floor, and try and press your back more open to the sky. Breathe. If you know the full pose, you're welcome to go into it. I'm going to just take it to here today. You can even feel pressing your lower back up and trying to lift your buttocks muscles up. Shoulders relax. And push a little bit where the stretch is okay for you to stretch. Sometimes we crunch the neck. If you take, for me, I'm quite flexible in the neck. So if I take my chin to the chest, it's too much. I keep a little bit pressing into the floor and then I get the stretch in the back of the neck instead of trying to make it too round. So I keep my throat open. I gently sit back onto your heels. Place your hands in front. Come up, tuck toes, lifting, downward facing dog. Step your right leg, that must be left leg forward, yes. Good, swivel the back foot. Stretching strongly into the legs, extend. And place, come, place your right hand down on the floor and reaching up. First, just push, lift, Open. If you can, the arm continues. 
can be on tippy fingers to make a little more space. And then we'll bend the left knee much more. Bend and stretch your right arm to the front. Now the back arm feels, for me, a bit squished in the muscles. So I'm going to sweep it. Try and rotate the upper body around and the legs stay. Breathe. Five, four, three, two, keep pulling, one, and place hands down. Join the feet in the front, extend your spine, exhale, fold. Inhale, strong in the legs, reach. Exhale, to stand. Good. Place your feet wide, sideways. Turn the toes out. Bend the knees. Hands onto the floor. And turn the toes inwards as much as you can. Even pigeon toes. So you can stretch the outside of your calf and bend a little bit into one side. So yeah, I don't know if you feel it. Get a nice stretch on the outer calf. Yeah, other side. Pigeon toe your toes facing much more inward and try and bend into that leg. Again, first side. Don't let the knee drop in. I don't think it's possible. Open the knee, sit in the middle of your foot. And second side again. Come onto your tippy fingers in the middle. The knees are welcome to stay a little bit bent. Press on your feet, lift the tummy, open your back, open your back, open your back. Feel like you're pressing your lower back up, lifting your tummy, lifting your hip bones, and then hold the tummy, but soften, uh, not the legs, I don't know where. It feels like sometimes I'm just softening in the shoulder area as I go down. Lift tummy and then soften as far forward as you can. Keep strength in the legs, breathe. Drop the head. Interlock your hands behind your neck. Don't yank on your head, but hug it in and try and lengthen the spinal column through the neck. So it's nice way you squeeze your elbows and you're holding your jawline with your forearms. Tuck your chin and pull. Inhale, placing your hands again, lifting up a little higher. Turn your feet 45 degrees outwards. You might want to make it a bit wide and walk yourself towards one side. Bend the knee and open up the inner thigh as much as you can. The heel might lift, the toes might lift. It's all good. Breathe. Press down onto your feet, come up, over to the other side. One more to each side, press down, find the strength in your legs. If your bum sticks out more than is needed, we can't find the strength of the legs. So always keep lifting from the stomach and the front. If I lift from the stomach, I'm almost forced to find the leg pressing me up. Last side. Press, feel the stomach lift, press. Good. Toe heel your feet together and you can step down as you come seated. Cross your ankles, come around to your buttocks. Let's go one leg, one leg, stretching arms out and take one leg over just as far as it can and roll back again. So it's like a little halasana. Keep your stomach up, press down, think of up with that other leg so you're not sunken, you're lifted at the belly. Keep changing, 
keep lifting. And don't, so the leg going up saves you from thinking that you have to go <laughs> too much. Don't push into the neck. Okay, next one, hold it there. Just as far as you can go over, keep the tummy lifted. Take both legs down towards the back, breathe. Slowly keep lifting the tummy, roll out, relax. Good. Place your hands behind you, scooping in the hip bones, lifting them up, and then opening the chest, just leaning into your hands. You go opposite direction with your spine. Press into the arms, rotating it, opening the pecs, lifting the pelvic floor, Exhale, release, lift tummy, and come forward to reach for the toes, Paschimottanasana. Inhale to come up. Good. We're still on the chakras. Let's do our chakra meditation. You can lie down on this one. You can stay seated. Mm. I'm going to chant nine times the, the long version of the Gayatri Mantra. And the long version includes the nine, seven planes of existence, earth into the sun energy into celestial energy and up into the unity consciousness. Om Bur, Om Bhavaha, Om Swaha, Om Maha, Om Janaha, Om Tapaha, Om Satyam. So as I say, those seven, Om Satyam, we go to the base. Let your mind just hop from chakra to chakra. Om Bur, Om Bhavaha, Om Swaha, Om Maha, Om Janaha, Om Tapaha, Om Satyam. And then the rest of the mantra, it's a mantra of light. And then you just visualize this fountain of light coming out of you and flowing all around, ready to come back to the earth plane, Ombur, Ombuvaha, Omswaha. Okay, so you're either seated or lying down. Get nice and comfy. Close the eyes. Relax the body. Settle, settle into the earth. Feel your body for a moment, releasing tension from the head, shoulders, arms, torso, hips, thighs, legs. Settle into natural silence your body will always move you don't have to keep it perfectly still think of softening now let the mind come into the space behind your closed eyes you visualize your body and you visualize that you coming up to the body with each Mantra. We start at the base. I'll do a slow one with you first. Go to the base. Om Bur. Go to the sacral. Om Bhuvaha. Go to the navel. Om Swaha. 
Go to the heart. Om Maha. To the throat. Om Janaha. To the third eye. Om Tapaha. To the crown. Om Satyam. Visualize the light coming out of your body and back into the base like the torus shape. Tatsavitur Varanyam. Vargo Devasyadi Mahi. Diyo Yonahat Prachodaya. Back down to the base. Om Bur, Om Bhuvaha, Om Swaha, Om Maha, Om Janaha, Om Tapaha, Om Satyam, Om Tatsavitur Varanyam, Vargaho Devasyadi Mahi, Diyo Yonahat Prachodayat, Om Bur, Om Bhuvaha, Om Swaha, Om Maha, Om Janaha, Om Tapaha, Om Satyam, Om Tatsavitur Varanyam Vargo Devasyadi Mahi Diyo Yonahat Prachodaya Om Bhur Om Bhuvaha Om Swaha Om Maha Om Janaha Om Tapaha Om Satyam Om Tatsavitur Varanyam Vargo Devasyadi Mahi Diyo Yonahat Prachodaya Om Bhur Om Bhuvaha Om Swaha, Om Maha, Om Janaha, Om Tapaha, Om Satyam. Tatsavitur Varanyam, Vargo Devasyadi Mahi, Diyo Yonahat Prachodayat. Om Bhur, Om Bhuvaha, Om Swaha, Om Maha, Om Janaha, Om Tapaha, Om Satyam. Om Tatsavitur Varanyam, Vargo Devasyadi Mahi, Diyo Yonahat Prachodayat Om Bhur, Om Bhuvaha, Om Swaha, Om Maha, Om Janaha, Om Tapaha, Om Satyam Tatsavitur Varanyam Vargo Devasyadi Mahi Diyo Yonahat Prachodayat Om Bhur, Om Bhuvaha, Om Swaha, Om Maha, Om Janaha, Om Tapaha, Om Satyam Om Tatsavitur Varanyam Vargo Devasyadi Mahi Diyo Yonahat Prachodayat Om Bhur Om Bhuvaha Om Swaha Om Maha Om Janaha Om Tapa Om Satyam Om Tatsavitur Varanyam Vargo Devasyadi Mahi Diyo Yonahat Prachodayat Continue sitting in silence, feeling your awakened energy field. Gently letting what you don't need and what is working against you to gently move out. Don't force, allow it out. And invite that that works for you, that is in harmony with your soul to come in. Even if you can just feel that you're opening the doors this morning, invite it. Good. Let this body be healthy, happy. Let this mind be healthy, happy. May peace be with you all. Namaste. Take a deep breath when you're ready. <sighs> Letting go. When you're ready, you can come back. Have a beautiful day.